This is a part four video where I'll be adding to my solar setup. First we'll be adding an eco-worthy 12.8 volt, 100 amp hour lithium battery. On the top of the battery you'll see your positive and negative terminal and two pull out handles to carry the battery. Now we've lined the batteries up, I'm going to remove the covers from the second battery and then remove the bolts from the negative and positive wires as we look to add more battery cables in parallel keeping the positive connected to the positive terminals and the negative connected to the negative. When connecting up two cables I use the bolts that come with the battery connecting the 9 inch battery cable from battery to battery. I use a slightly longer bolt when connecting three cables as the bolt that come with the battery was too short for three. Connecting up three batteries in parallel will extend my battery life to 300 amp hours at 12 volts. The positive wire from the charge controller and the inverter are connected to the positive terminal on the third battery and the negative cable from the charge controller and the inverter is connected to the first battery. And then I have my 9 inch battery cables connected in parallel connecting from battery to battery. I also add an extra 170 watt solar panel to this solar setup to increase the amount of solar energy collected and stored in the batteries. Now I look to cover up the positive and negative terminals using these battery terminal covers to prevent anything from touching the bolts. And here I cut sections out of the covers to suit the wire layout. And the last thing is to add plastic cable ties to hold these in place. Here I've added a fourth panel connected to the other three in series. Ideally you connect all four of these panels next to each other at the best angle facing towards the sun to ensure the maximum amount you'll get out of these panels. The Victron charge controller you can connect to via Bluetooth which will show you all your solar panel and battery stats and here you'll be able to check for your history. The white graph will turn to light blue when the battery is full. The charge controller will change from bulk to float. This is a great charge controller which I've paired up with a 2000 watt Renogy pure sine wave inverter which comes with a 3 meter remote switch allowing you to have a socket on the wall away from the inverter that's more convenient to access flip the switch which will turn the inverter on which will use the energy stored in your lithium batteries from DC to AC power here I have some outside lights connected which lights up the balcony at night but we also have an outside socket allowing me to plug in other devices thanks for watching, I'll leave links and information in the description below Subscribe and like, welcome to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.